OMG! 10,000! We hit 10,000, people! Who would have thought that would have happened? Yep, right there. You're seeing it. 10,000 right there. 10,000. Holy cow. I would have never thought that I would be able to do to affect people in subscribing to a channel, especially one like mine that's reaction. And a lot of it has to do with the fact that I really enjoy music. I really believe that there's a lot of you guys uh, that are subscribers that enjoy music just as much as I do. And I think a lot of it uh, shows in um, in you guys' subscription to uh, this little guy, Wolfrock. And I want to give a big shout out to all you guys for coming along on my journey. We have not even hit a year yet on this YouTube channel and we're at 10,000 subscribers, which is phenomenal and amazing. And a lot of that is for you guys. Um, so I do appreciate it a whole bunch. Definitely my love and respect for you guys for coming along. Um, one of the things that I told you guys I would do is a kind of a question and answer. I know it's a very generic thing. I think a lot of YouTubers out there do the same thing. But a lot of it for me, I think a question and answer gets me to know you guys. I've gotten to know some of you guys on actual uh, comments and stuff like that, which is kind of cool. And especially on live streams, uh, there's a lot of you guys that are really funny to listen to as you guys uh, talk back and forth. Um, and some of you guys, you guys know who I'm talking to, especially this one specific subscriber that seems every time we do a YouTube live stream with Dimash, for some reason, there's always dishes involved. It seems like the dishes never get done with this person. So I'm not going to pull you out. I'm not going to call you out, but you know who you are. <laughs> you need to get your dishes done before the live stream. Um, and as you guys know, my live streams have kind of switched over to Facebook when it comes to Dimash. Um, I've noticed that I've had zero problems, zero problems with uh, Facebook when it came to uh, videos. YouTube, take note. <laughs> Just saying. Um, anyway, a uh, big shout out on the 10,000 mark. This is a question and answer. Please leave your questions at the bottom of this video in this comments of any questions you would like to ask. Um, like I said, I'm very transparent in my life. I would like to know you guys as much as I, I want you guys want to know me. Obviously, you guys know me enough that through my videos that I'm pretty transparent. And I wanted to answer this one question that someone asked me uh, way back when. And I was kind of waiting until I got to a certain number in, as a goal, but I kind of threw that out because I really didn't care. I was more focused on the music than I was in anything else. And the respect and love that you guys have shown me, I want to give that back to you guys. And one of the questions I've been asked was, why did you start a YouTube channel? So I actually have two. So you, you know, I have my metal music that I do love metal. It's been part of my life uh, since I was growing up. But I started a second uh, channel because I also am in, I have a love for classical music and opera music in general. That's kind of my background because of my mother. And so I wanted to share the passion of music with others. And I wanted to affect other people, not just the metal group. Um, I got some lashback when I posted a video uh, when I first started my metal channel of a, an opera singer that I really loved. And oh my God, they went crazy. They're like, this is metal. This is not metal. This is not metal. I was like, oh my God, slow your roll. <laughs> But then I started to uh, understand that uh, some people that are in music, uh, that love music, are set in one specific genre. And they kind of just stay there. They don't want to leave that. They don't want to explore other things. Because they're set in how they feel comfortable in that genre. When they get out of that genre, they start feeling different emotions. And they're like, I don't like this. And so I'm going to just stick in my little bubble and stay in my genre. And that's the reason why I think I, I wanted to have other people ex, uh, enjoy music through this other channel, that we explore new artists, new uh, music that some of us have never experienced. And this is why I started this channel, so that all of us collectively as a, as a globe can come together and just enjoy music. And um, we don't use this word on our channel because it's not a word that is, is it's really frowned upon, especially with me, is the word hate. Hate is not a good word, and um, you may not like some music, you might even dislike some music, but you just don't use the word hate. It's just not a good word. Now, if you look up the de definition of hate and look at the definition of dislike, there's a big contrast between the two. Just saying. Anyway, 
getting back to my point. So the whole idea of me starting this channel was to get people involved in that. And also to get people outside their bubble of genre and get them to experience. Dimash, for example, great example. Dimash has an, a range that's all over the place. And I would have never experienced Dimash in my own life if somebody did not suggest it on this channel. And Dimash is, I'm a big fan of Dimash. i just be honest with you. I'm a dear, I love Dimash. He's an awesome, 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 awesome person uh, to watch him collectively bring unity to our world. And I, he does it through music. It's a beautiful thing. Angelina Jordan is another one that I would have never experienced and never, uh, I would never have known if I didn't have the time and the energy that you guys have given me to say, hey, check out this person. You might like her. And there's also um, Mondays. I do feature artists Mondays. Man, it's amazing. I've gotten into new artists that I've never would have experienced it if you guys didn't suggest it. And also us together collectively have gotten to uh, experience new music. That is the reason why I, and plus I'm very passionate about music. Very passionate. I, there's a lot of things that you guys don't know about me, but that's the reason why I did the question and answer so you guys can give me some time and uh, give me your questions. I will do it. I will answer every question I can get off a, on a video. So this will be, we'll call this part one. And then the next video will be part two when we do the answer and question. In the same comments, let me know if you guys want me to do it as a live stream answer or if you guys want me to do it as a part two video like this. But the part two could be a live stream instead of just a recorded video. Give me your thoughts. What do you guys think? I think it's just amazing. But can you imagine 10,000? Never would have thought of it. It's just amazing to me. Much love and respect to you guys. As always, stay classic because that's what we're all about here. We stay classic all the way through. So thank you guys. You guys are the best. Love you guys. Let's continue on with this journey and let's plug through with more music. And as you guys know, it's Feature Artist Monday. So that's coming up next.